Move your bottom Milo. All right, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is Thursday and I am doing a get ready with me for my 100 subscriber special. Yay. Yay. It's just gonna be a chit chat, get ready with me because I was going to get my smiley pierced, this little piece of skin under your lip and it like is a like a horseshoe and it hangs down in front of your teeth. So cute. I was gonna go do that on Monday. Well, every tattoo and piercing shop was closed because it was Monday and it was eight o'clock. So you may be disappointed in this 100 subscriber special, but that video is coming. I filmed a lot of it. I just gotta go get my smiley. So it might be a couple weeks because I'm also quite poor. I just went on a run. I ran a mile and a half at like 9.15 pace. I'm training for a 10K. This one I'm actually training for, so that's good. But I just took a shower. This is what I use for face wash. This is what I use for toner. This is my medicated clindamycin that I put all over my face whenever I get out of the shower. And then I use Pond's face lotion, which I heard is not good for your pores, but it doesn't really bother mine because I kind of have dry skin. I use this for deodorant. I'm so appreciative of my 100 subscribers. This has been a goal of mine since I started my channel and I started it in 2018. And it's so nice to have an audience that's watching my videos. Um, Cause I'm really passionate about video editing. I'm really passionate about filming. I love YouTube. So I'm just thankful that there are people out there who are watching, even if they don't actually care. It means the world to me, so. If you're subscribed, thank you for subscribing. I would like to give a special shout out to Stuart Manning from Colorado for being my 100th subscriber. So he has supported my art, he has supported my video making. We had one class together in high school and we had Deca together and we got to know each other really well and he still continues to support me even five, six years later. So it's really cool, so thank you Stuart. So I'm already basically ready because I'm quite low maintenance. I'm going to the bars tonight with my friends, and we're just gonna go have a couple drinks, dance, have a good time. I had a period of time where I wasn't drinking very much at all because I was going through some trauma, I was going through some problems that I was solving with alcohol. So I took a long break, I did. Oh, I have a tripod, no hands. Um, I thought it was gonna be a little bit taller. I decided to buy a tripod because I wanted to up my YouTube channel game. So it's gonna stand on this little table while we get ready. But anyway, so I took a break from drinking for a while. I just started kind of going out with my friends a little bit more. I'm trying to hang out with my friends more because I went through a breakup a couple months ago, which is silly. I've been going through something. To be honest with you guys, I've been going through a lot. I just got my window fixed because it got shattered. I will not elaborate on that. Ooh, what should I wear tonight? I'm out of storage. I need to buy an actual camera with an actual memory card if I'm gonna keep doing this YouTube thing with my 100 subscribers. I'm wearing these with a big t-shirt because I could not be bothered. Anyways, I've been going through some stuff. It's been fine, I'll be fine. I'm pissed that my phone is out of storage. I just bought this tripod. Okay, I'm going with an animal theme today with the animal shirt and then the biker shorts. And I'm gonna put on my, if I can find my other one, my Reeboks with the straps, cause those are for the club. Milo smells like shit because <laughs> we went on a walk this morning with my friend Shelby, like nice three mile walk. And then we went on a mile and a half run just now. I'm trying to get back into running so I can have a hot girl summer. Oh my God, I forgot to tell you guys. I said it in my other video that's not gonna be my 100 subscriber special that I wanted it to be. I started my full-time job. I am a full-time graphic designer for a little FinTech here in Lincoln. And I just sit at my desk and design all day long. It's fucking fantastic. It's my dream. And I just, I'm about to finish my first week. So that's really exciting. I love these shoes. They make me look like Sue Heck. Did you guys ever watch The Middle? Fit check. Who is she? Okay, here's the jewelry for tonight. I'm wearing these evil eye earrings that an ex-boyfriend from a long time ago got me. And then I'm gonna put in these fortune tarot card earrings. 
My Labradorite ring. My sun and moon ring goes on my owie thumb. I'm gonna have a tomato thumb, it's gross. Old mood ring that doesn't work, middle finger, and my emerald on the middle. And then I'm wearing this flower agate pendant that I got from a TikTok live. That's it. Just dropped it. This little pendant, this wire wrapped. Jesus fucking Christ. Sorry. Can you see me sweating? It's whenever I get out of the shower after I run, I'm always really sweaty because my body hasn't cooled down yet. I forgot to show you I'm wearing my Taurus necklace from Target. And then this is a, I think it's red jasper. It's a big wire wrapped stone that my sister's high school friend named Luke wrapped. And I bought it years and years ago. And I just found it not that long ago. So these are the necklaces, the rings, the earrings. Let's do some makeup. This tripod's kind of sick, I'm not gonna lie. The key to doing my makeup is quite simple actually. It's called curl your eyelashes, put on mascara and do your eyebrows. I use this pen, this NYX professional makeup micro brow pencil in espresso. And I just fill in the brows, kind of shape them up a little bit. I don't have very strong brows at the tail, so I just add a little bit of it my own tail. And I don't add anything else, I just fill in what's already there. And since I'm sweaty, I can just wipe off <laughs> anything that's a little too dramatic. Here's my brows. Told you. Oh, this one needs a little right there. And my method is if it's too thick, you just rub it a little bit. This eyelash curler pinches my eyeball, but this one doesn't really work. So I'm gonna use this one that doesn't really work because I don't feel like pinching my eyeball. Oh, that kind of worked. Wow, I look so feminine. What I've realized is if you wear hoops, any outfit immediately is elevated. So I might switch into some hoops. This mascara is like six years old. So while I do have my full-time job, unfortunately, I still have one more semester because I failed a class this semester, my first time failing a class in five years of school. And it was the last class I needed for my graphic design degree. So I failed it like an idiot. So I have to take a Spanish class for some reason. I have to take like four marketing classes to get my marketing degree. And I was going to do it in the summer, but my scholarship doesn't cover the summer semester. But I have my job already, so I just have to graduate. That's next on the list. If you get it on your eye, above your eye, if you're sweaty, you can just wipe it off. Well, fortunately or unfortunately, the only hoops that I currently own are rose gold and comically large. I don't even know if I can get this in my ear hole. Like, comically. That's pretty cute, actually. And then I just grab my straightener, I'm gonna straighten my hair. So, my life is pretty hilarious. Um, me and Chad broke up, which is bad news bears because we still live together. And it's kind of hard to live with your ex, as I'm sure you understand. We'll still hang out sometimes, but we're really just kind of doing our own thing, which is nice. And my friends have really rallied around me and supported me during this hard breakup, which has been really cool and I'm really thankful for them. I'm almost done with my hair, but I wanted to kind of talk to you guys about some YouTubers that I've been really liking watching and some people I think you should watch if you like the type of content I make or if you like things that I like. I watch a lot of commentary YouTube videos and I watch social commentary as well as movie, TV, video commentary. So I'll watch people watch other things, which sounds a little stupid when I could just watch the thing myself. I potentially thought about doing some, trying to do some commentary videos, just coming up with the logistics of it and screen recording and editing is a little more intense than the vlog style that I make. If you like the vlog style that I make, I would recommend Emma Chamberlain, um, obviously. She's one of my big inspirations for my YouTube channel, but she hasn't posted in a really long time, and so I don't really watch a ton of her videos anymore. But she was really big when I started posting on YouTube again, not that long ago, like a couple years ago. And so I wanted to shout her out for inspiring me to continue to make videos. Another YouTuber that I'm obsessed with is Sarah Baska. If you guys know her, 
I feel like I have a deep soul connection with Sarah Baskin, which is just a parasocial relationship. But she's a Taurus. She's funny. She's sweet. She's genuine. She's spiritual. And I just relate to her a lot because I'm so funny, genuine, spiritual, and relatable. No, I just, she makes me feel like I'm not alone. Okay, I just deleted TikTok because it was taking up six gigabytes and I want to finish filming this. So don't say I never did anything for you, subscribers, because I just deleted TikTok for you. So there goes all my drafts. So I love Sarah Baska. She played Life is Strange, it was so funny. I cried with her when she, Life is Strange too. if you know, you know, I cried with her. And then when she posted her San Francisco vlog, I cried with her. So I've just been following her for a really long time and she's really a big inspiration for me. Some commentary YouTubers I like, obviously Drew Gooden, Danny Gonzalez, Cody Ko, Noel Miller. You can watch my very first video here. I've been watching them for years. I also watch Aaron and Joe, they're pretty funny, as well as Nick DeRamio is one of my absolute favorites and he is a comfort YouTuber for me. So if you need some new people to watch, I would check them out. I also really like the podcast by Sarah Shower and Kendall, Kendall Landreth, the BCC Club. They're really funny. I also listen to Rhett and Link's podcast sometimes, the Ear Biscuits podcast, as well as Tiny Meat Gang with Cody and Noel. I also really like true crime, so I watch Bailey Sarian do Murder Mystery and Makeup Monday. And, I, ooh, something I've really been liking is Fundy Fridays by Jen something. I can't remember her last name. I'll put it right here. She explores the fundamentalisms of Christianity and everything that that encompasses. So if that's something that interests you, check it out. Also, a social commentary channel that I really like is Tiffany Ferg. She does internet analysis and talks about social issues in media, which is really cool. Check out some of those YouTubers if you like and kind of see where I get my inspiration and see what they teach you because they teach you stuff about content, they teach you stuff about the internet, teach you stuff about social norms. So yeah, my hair is done, I'm ready to go. I am going to go to the gas station and pick up some 99 Beach shooters and try not to throw them up because I did a group therapy, which is like a bike tour um, here in Lincoln that's pretty popular. I did one of those on Tuesday and I took two shooters and threw it before we even got on the bike. So I'm gonna try not to throw up tonight. Oh my God, you better fucking stop it right now. Milo, you are so cute. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this will do as a 100 subscriber special. If you want another special that's a little more special, subscribe and I will do another one every 100 subscribers because that would be exciting. I'm feeling squirrely, to the bars we go. I'm gonna go to Taylor's house and pregame. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. I would appreciate the like. Leave a comment if you'd like. And subscribe if you haven't because I will be rolling out these specials, baby. You won't even believe it. But I will see you guys later. Stay tuned for my smiley piercing. That video's coming whenever I get it. I forgot to say I love you. I love you. Maybe. Have a good day. Bye.